The five, we're staying with this story tonight after hearing from dozens of you who say you're not getting your mail and packages on time. Now, we first told you about this and we broke this story last night at six. Well, tonight, one woman telling us she paid extra money for faster shipping and now her son's items are lost in a postal bin in Alabama. Bria Chapman now live and on your side to give us this update. Yes, there. So as of now, it is still lost. I reached out to USPS with Marquita Smith's tracking number. They told me it's showing no scan. She says she's called her local post office and also the post office in Kansas where she was sending the package. They told her they can't find it and she might be able to file a claim later in the next month or so and maybe get some of her money back. And now her son is headed off without the things he needs. She's also afraid because some of the documents she was she was shipping had very personal and sensitive information. She was sending it all off to her son, who's a soldier so, serving in the army at Fort Riley, Kansas. Now she mailed everything off early so he would get them in time before he left to compete in the Sullivan Cup. Now that's a that's a major army competition, and he'll leave later this week without that package. And Smith feels like that no one with the United States Postal Service cares about this issue or the items inside that means so much to her and her family. He has got back into church and he wanted his Bible, but he didn't want just his Bible. He wanted the family heirloom Bible and that is in there. And I wrote him something special inside of it. So it really meant a lot to me to get it to him. There's a gold bracelet inside and it had a the Lord's Prayer inscripted on it. And I got that for him when he graduated high school. And I wanted him to have it with him so he could keep God with him wherever he went with everything that our soldiers go through. And now we don't know where any of it is. And it's just frustrating for them to act like it's just no big deal or they don't care. Yeah, Smith says she noticed problems with USPS a few, in the last few months, and the incident with her son has left her extremely upset and frustrated. Now, I reached back out to USPS for a statement, and they shared this. Quote, local management is aware of the concerns of some customers, and we are working quickly to resolve any service issues. Now, if you'd like to get in contact with the Postal Service, we have that information posted right now on our WBRC News app. Reporting live in Birmingham, I'm Bria Chapman, WBRC, Fox 6 News on your side.